This alien looking structure is actually an inflorescence composed of many tiny little flowers. Today we're talking about elephant foot yam. Let's botanize. At the moment, this reproductive structure is the entire above ground portion of this plant, Amorphophallus peonifolius. When it's done flowering, it'll send up a single large vegetative leaf, which you can see forming right here. So let's break down the structure of this inflorescence. On the outside, we have this fleshy modified leaf-like structure called a spathe. Inner to that, we have this column called the spadix. Here at the bottom of the spadix are a cluster of tiny flowers. These individual flowers are unisexual. The ones on the top only produce pollen, and the ones on the bottom only produce seeds and fruits. This inflorescence emits an acrid odor, and if you look carefully, kind of looks like rotting meat. This reflects its pollination syndrome, attracting flies and beetles which seek out rotting flesh. Interestingly, some of the largest inflorescences are composed of some of the smallest flowers. This is true of this family, the Aeraceae, the palms, the Aeracaceae, and the sunflowers, Asteraceae. In lineages with small flowers, it might be easier to aggregate individual flowers to evolve large inflorescences than it is to evolve larger individual flowers. 